Catch as catch can, or catch wrestling if you prefer to shorten it, is a combative sport that's lineage can be traced all the way back to England during the 19th century. And while at first glance, it may look similar to BJJ, the two arts couldn't be any more different in principle and technique. While many see BJJ as the gentle art form, catch wrestling is seen as its polar opposite, focusing on hurting and hooking any limb you can get your hands on. And whereas leg locks and knee bars may be considered taboo or dirty in some styles of BJJ, in catch wrestling, it's seen as just another way to hook and stretch your opponent. There is no pulling guard in catch as catch can, and in fact, most catch wrestlers or shooters as they're commonly referred to are not comfortable with being bottom position, mostly because in catch wrestling, you can be pinned and this will cause you to lose the match. This alone separates the mentality of a shooter and a Brazilian Jiu Jitsu practitioner. Other differences include the ability to slam and suplex your opponent, which is illegal in BJJ tournaments, and matches are conducted in two out of three falls, with the victor winning by the aforementioned pinfall or submission. Catch wrestling achieved its peak of popularity during the Roaring Twenties. In fact, from the 1900s to the 1920s, catch wrestling's popularity was second only to baseball, and superstars like Frank Gotch, George Hackenschmidt, Strangler Ed Lewis, and Farmer Burns were household names. Gotch and Hackenschmidt would wrestle for the right to be called the world's undisputed champion in 1908 and 1911. Gotch won both matches. Today, catch wrestling is seen as having a resurgence thanks to people like Billy Robinson who taught the art form to modern fighters like Josh Barnett, and to Carl Gotch who taught the art form in Japan, which helped set base for what would become known today as MMA. Here's a fun fact before the end of this video. Did you know that the phrase Saint Uncle originated from catch wrestling as a verbal sign of submission? So if you ever said Saint Uncle while picking on a younger sibling, that's just the result of catch wrestling being so popular at one point in time that the term has managed to travel through different eras. And that's pretty cool if you ask me. Thank you so much for watching ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on combat sports and martial arts. Don't forget to hit that bell icon either, and if you want to follow us on social media, you definitely can at Iron Kumite on Instagram and Twitter, and if you have any ideas for the channel, let me know in the comment section below. And until next time, stay sharp everyone.